Hey hey, this is your channel, The Lazy Architecto, helping you in reaching our dreams to be an architect. Today's tip is a custom or two custom commands that I created for my personal use, which I love them. And they are the isolate height and the isolate fade. Now let me explain you when and why um, we can use these two powerful commands. Example one, let's say I want to hatch this other restroom the way that I did it in this case, which this hatch means by the way, uh, jeep, jeep port. Now, if we use the normal hatch, can you see what happens? It comes in pieces. But if we use our isolate height, we can select this, enter, hatch, and boom. Now we go unisolate, and we have our restroom ready. You see how easy it was? Now example two, let's say I want to count how many of these lights I have on my reflective ceiling plan. All I had to do is isolate height, click on my light, enter, select my lights, and now you can see with my quick properties that I have 161 lights, uh, 2 by 4 lights by the way. See how easy it was? Now isolate again. Now let's explain when can we use the isolate fade command. For instance, let's say right now from this wall I, to the restroom wall I have 10 feet 2 and let's say I wanted to have only 9 feet so if I try to stretch these restrooms, see what happened. So let's use now the fate, isolate fate command. We're going to need this, 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 and finally this. Enter. Now we can stretch this. from here from this wall we said we need 9 feet so 9 feet enter can you see how easy it was and it's so perfectly aligned now we're gonna do an isolate and all we had to do is fix our hatch Can you see how easy it was? So let's explain how do we create these two powerful commands. As you can see, I removed them already so I can um, redo it. Let's go to the CUI, enter, ribbon, panels, home layers row one and for this we need to remove two commands from the home layers i'm going to remove layer isolate because this is the basic isolate we're not going to need it anymore and one more is i'm going to remove the previous because i never use it you can remove other one if you want and don't worry because these commands are here at the bottom so you can put it back whenever you want now gonna do isolate as you can see i already have my isolate high and fade but i will create it again for you so you can see duplicate rename it height enter 
and since I already have my macro that I created I will copy and I will paste it right here a brief description is CC for scape L ISO command S for settings and off uh, which means the layer off okay now the next step is to add the letter um, H for height and we're gonna do it here edit red grid and we're gonna draw a big letter H Undo, undo, undo. Can remove this right here. Okay, so now we're going to export it. I'm going to rename it Isolate Height. Save and close. And no, because we don't want to overwrite the existing icon. Now we're going to go here, select it the same here for large image okay now this command is ready now we had to do the same process for the isolate fade gonna go here we're gonna duplicate rename it fade enter again since I'm already I already have this macro I will copy I will paste it in here. A brief description CC for escape, lay ISO command, S for settings, L for lock and fade, and 70 for 70%. 70 okay, the last step is to add the letter. So we're going to do a big F. We're going to export it. Isolate, fade, save, close, no. And then we're going to assign that icon to the command. Okay, we're almost ready. So now all we need to do is grab our brand new commands and then left click on them and drag it over here now apply and okay as you can see right here boom here you have them you can use it I'm gonna test it really quick so hide, click, enter, and isolate, fade, click, enter, boom. All right, guys, that was the tip for today. If you found this video helpful, leave some comments below, subscribe for future videos, and if you have any questions, also leave them in the comments below. Alright, see you next time.